When we designed the Fender Fortis loudspeakers, we really had four primary things in mind. To make them flexible, powerful, durable, and musical. You really don't know what you're going to get when you arrive at a venue. You might use speakers for wedges, front of house. You really don't know the acoustics of the room. So you really want to have as much flexibility as possible. On the back panel, we have three mixable inputs. Input one handles line level signals with either XLR or quarter inch jacks. Input two handles microphone or line input signals. And the third one's unique, it's Bluetooth. So this box is Bluetooth enabled. It gives you the ability to accept high quality stereo Bluetooth signal input. And then when you go down to the section just below this, you have two outputs, an extension output and a loop output, and you have a stereo or mono button. That stereo or mono button engages when you push it into stereo mode, it feeds the right side of Bluetooth to an additional speaker. So I've got true stereo going to both speakers. And then from there, I can daisy chain additional four to speakers and keep it in stereo. Now we'll talk about the EQ section a little bit. There's seven different EQ points were meticulously chosen by the Fender R&D engineers who are very musical people. Whether it's vocal applications or bass boost with DJ applications, there's seven different positions that cover those different types of applications. I'm gonna go to the outside of the box a little bit. There are two different monitor angles with the floor wedge built into this design, 38 degrees and 53 degrees. So I don't have to do any propping up with shims and things like that to get the angle that I want. Additionally, I have two pole mount angles. One is uh, vertical, the other one is 7.5 degree downward tilt. So if you're performing on a stage and the audience is below the stage, the 7.5 degree downward tilt is very useful because that means you're gonna cover the audience instead of shooting over the audience's heads. This is a very powerful box, it's 1300 watts, it puts out 135 dB SPL. But what's unique about the way that we do the power is that we have two channels of amplification. A thousand watts of that power is dedicated to the low frequency driver where it can be used. Low frequencies take a lot more power than high frequencies. But when you add the 18 inch subwoofer, which is a thousand watt subwoofer, that just expands the possibility. So I can do much larger venues with an 18 inch subwoofer coupled with one of the mid high boxes, the 10, the 12 or the 15. There are crossover points dedicated to each of those three boxes We've also included, just as an extra precaution, uh, on-demand fan, which means that the fan kicks in only when it's necessary and only as much as needed. These have an industry best five-year out-of-box warranty. The construction is birch ply, and it also has M10 rigging hardware, which means that you can permanently install these boxes. Also have a hard poly coat finish on the outside, perforated steel grill. We use the finest components so this box is meant to last under really rigorous conditions. So if you go out and do a lot of gigs and you wanna make one investment for a long period of time, this is a great way to go. Fender is known as a musical company from the guitars to the amplifiers to anything else that we're making. Musicality is very important, it's what we're known for. There's a lot of thought that goes into component choices, cabinet voicing, all those kinds of things. But what it means is you're gonna to have tones that match up with the tone source. So acoustic guitars are gonna sound natural. Electric guitar tones are gonna to come through. Vocal tones, all those things are gonna to come through naturally. And it's very, very important to Fender to make a box, just like all the other things that we make that are musical professional tools for musicians. So with all that, I think you're getting a tremendous value with Fender Forte speakers. Thank <laughs> you.